All right, we are at the track of world champion Sulikai in Thailand. I have my race of P3M. And we're gonna do some final laps before we go home to the Philippines. Ah, Nitro! Ooh. So we spent the entire day, we started at um, 18 second lap times, we're now down to 16. It's basically a lot of fine tuning, um, getting the camber right, getting the ride height perfect. Basically we want the front and the rear to roll, uh, roll correctly, like they're not fighting each other. Uh, so my driver feedback was that this car is now effortless to drive. It does not stick into the corner. It just flows. Uh, so it's faster now and it's also easier to drive because the, the car balance is better than before. So it's really a lot of uh, small adjustments, uh, especially on the right eye front to rear and the roll centers. Mm, I don't have rolled uh, sway bars but it's actually I tested with sway bars and we decided that no sway bar was actually better for, for today so yeah uh, we've been in Thailand for like uh, three weeks this is our second day in this track and we're kind of almost at the at the pace of the locals with a T3M right <laughs> the car that many try to get a grips on but uh, actually it's better now than our Mugen MTC2 which we raced in TITC uh, yeah this is for her this is the best handling car we have uh, we have since we came to Thailand we spent a lot of time on the Mugen like 15 days trying to set it up <laughs> this one only today and it's already driving better than the MTC2 in her in her feel also the lap time this is faster than the MTC2 at the moment yeah. For me, I'm not sponsored, so we pick the better car. Uh, you know, we try to tune everything. Tune the Mugen, tune the race off. Uh, all good. Yeah, so this is the track of uh, world champion Surikan. We finally got a chance to visit and play. And he's here today, so at least my daughter got a chance to meet him. Uh, yeah, so our Thailand trip is uh, very, uh, very well worth it. It's a lot of memories that we will not, uh, we will keep until we die. <laughs> and yeah, she's, she's really, you know, getting better at driving now, more flow. The car setup is also getting better, yeah. So I think the T3M platform, this is version 1, not even version 2. And even without sway bar, um, yeah, it can run pretty well. I just adjusted the uh, roll centers. Huh? What happened? This one? Yeah, getting better, the setup around... 16 seconds now, not 18. <laughs> Earlier it was 18, but now she says more, more easy to drive now. Balance is better. 
The rolling is better. Huh? Oh. Oh. Your friend? Ah, her? Ah, yeah. It's getting better. More, more flow. More. Getting used to the car in the truck. Very <laughs> smooth. Smooth? Yeah. I make her drive smooth. <laughs> it got me very rough. <laughs> but, but now more flow, more smooth. Yeah. Maybe next year we can now fight this car better than the new game. <laughs> see you, see you. Uh, yeah. So that's how a T3M can run. We're only using a Hobbywing Quick Run ESC. That cheap $50 ESC. Motor is a surpass 5.5 turn. So it's still okay, yeah. Not bad. Um, the EC lasts more than five minutes, so it's okay. Uh, no need for the XR10 Pro, which we also have. We have the XR10 Pro, the expensive ESC, but cheap one can go fast as well. Uh, what else? Ah, uh, yeah. All right, tires are loose, losing grip, but. I think overall she enjoyed this this car. Yeah, the sway bars are typically a problem in the design, so just don't use them. <laughs> I tuned the the I tuned the roll with the roll center shims under the pivot balls, and also with the spring hardness and the ride height. Plus, the, maybe a camber gain, the upper links, help uh, adjust the roll as well. And what I do, I also measure the tire temp on each tire, and also the inner and outer temp of each tire. And actually, this is very well balanced at the moment in terms of tire temp, uh, even without roll bar. With roll bars, I feel the tire temp become uneven. The outer tire gets more heat. So... To each his own, to each his own, but I'll take this car right now. I, I might buy another version one. <laughs> I'm still using the RAS Shocks uh, 500 weight oil. Then I think I'm using the Raced Up 2.9 Springs, the gold ones, but fully leaned in on the shock tower to make it as soft as possible. And yeah. I think she's enjoying I'm enjoying hope you guys are enjoying this uh, video as well and uh, the, the pit areas over there with all the shops these are VIP rooms you can rent them people stay here they live here see they, they live inside the truck <laughs> and there are more VIP rooms outside oh Thailand First class RC facility. <laughs> Alright. Indoor asphalt with VIP room. Alright. T3M. Alright, cheers.